just another day. It's another another, another beautiful day. The birds are singing. The women are screaming. We, I don't get paid for this, and neither do you. Why are we still here? <laughs> the bird, the birds are singing. The women are screaming. Screw and, the uh, birds. That's right. Fuck them. <laughs> no, no, don't fuck the birds. What? Because I said wow. so. First, you're telling me I can't drive on the other side of the road, and now this. Like what? <sighs> like what the hell? Like hold on. Doodaloo. Hey. Oh, that's the fastest. Ow! That's the fastest break I've had to take on this podcast. Everybody, warm. Give it. Give it a. Give it a good applause. Give it a warm. You did a really good job. <laughs> My brother was on the way, but I didn't know when he would arrive, and here he is. So um, he's Sick. at my apartment. Um, Sick. But yeah, we're we're at episode thirty of the Generally Speaking podcast. I'm your host, That's uh, right. General Ars. That's an achievement. And, yeah, yeah. That's an achievement. That's an achievement. We're at episode thirty. That's uh, half away from sixty. Yeah. Which is which is gonna be. And who really liked that number sixty? Yeah. Do you know the answer? Uh, Joey for friends. I don't fucking watch friends. I I just, just replied with something. I like that. I like that positive attitude. I'm not even gonna give you the correct answer. That should be the correct answer. P- uh, Peter Simpson, Homer Griffin. Fuck. I don't know. Are you having like an aneurysm? <laughs> My brain don't work so good. My brain don't work so good. My brain think I are half stupid. <laughs> I am half stupid, guys. Do you ever um, have stupid? <laughs> yeah. But, um, yeah, well, well, it, it, new podcast, <coughs> another day, another podcast. Uh, Wall Seeker <gasps> still hasn't moved to the new apartment. Uh, and I'm I, still uh, home alone most days. You know, my, my, and not the movie. Yeah, not you're not like the movie. Yeah, there's always, there's that always means- two, two middle aged men trying to break into my house and I, I gotta fend them off by setting up traps in my apartment. Yeah, homeless people. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> These homeless people, they keep trying to break into my house. I'm, I'm, That's right. I'm furious. I'm, I am, I'm losing my my marbles, as you can say. Yes, you are. Yes, you are. I, I haven't watched Home Alone in a while. Do you remember when we were in grade school and like every time it was the Christmas season and the teachers were like, eh, I don't feel like teaching. Let's just throw on Home Alone 1. They, they always did that. What? No. Uh, how do you know that? How do you know they're, they didn't want to teach and instead we I don't know. This? How do you know they didn't want to? I don't know. I, how do I, you know that you know, this wasn't a law? <gasps> that every school during Christmas <laughs> must play this movie? <laughs> yeah, what if? What if? Every grade school, they were like the government watching them and they would be like, hmm, guys, I see you haven't played Home Alone yet for, <laughs> during the Christmas season. <laughs> hey, you got to fill up on your Home Alone quota this yeah. year. Yeah, the, the home loan <coughs> taxes were being sent through, and the school was like, "Shit!" If they didn't, if they didn't play Home Alone, how much they they would have had to pay like I don't know, three hundred thousand, you know, million dollars. Whoa, dude, that's insanely. That's too much. That's hey, that's too high. I um, didn't like this. Hey man, I'm just. A, don't shoot the messenger, man. Don't shoot the messenger. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> um but yeah how, how how have you been how you been doing man i haven't actually you know, i haven't actually that. spoken to you i think since the last time we recorded podcast right maybe actually this yeah. weekend i think we we played a little bit maybe i think I we all well, we chat we chatted on sunday we chatted on sunday at least i remember that and then you had to leave well, I, I was gonna record the podcast with you on Sunday. By the way, guys, it's uh, Wednesday. Uh, but I was gonna oh, yeah. record <laughs> with you on oh, on yeah. Sunday, and then you had to do something, and so you know, I just played some yeah. games with my uh, our buddy Fasten. Um, and then I, I think, no, I didn't really do much that day. I also yeah. haven't streamed for three days in a row, and I was gonna stream today, but then apparently there's like this boycott going on for Twitch, where nobody, uh, like every streamer, it, not everyone's doing it, but like a lot of people were gonna not stream today due to Twitch um, not really focusing, that they, they haven't really implemented the tools uh, 
uh, uh, for like fighting like harass harassment accounts. Basically, people are making accounts where they're just targeting harassment towards like uh, streamers of color, LGBTQ members, like everything like that. And people are just mm -hmm. uh, just being heinous in the chats of these uh, of these streamers. Um, mm. And and Twitch hasn't really done much about it. And so today was supposed to be a sort of day to like, you know, not stream, you know, take, uh, take, you know, stand in, stand in solitude. I don't know if I'm using the word right. And just, you know, you know, not yeah, stream today. Yeah. I'm not, I'm don't. not an in English literature. I don't know. I don't <laughs> I, I'm not a book. I'm not a dictionary. What the fuck? I don't have, yeah, I don't have a PhD <laughs> on my wall. Okay pretty huge dick yeah <laughs> well i have one of those in my wall what the hell um but yeah so i i've decided like okay whatever i won't stream today i'll stream tomorrow because i you know i i agree i think this i think yeah. this is a problem and twitch should uh, should like address this and do something about it but I, I did go on Twitch earlier and saw that like a lot of my favorite streamers are live anyways, and a lot of people are streaming, and so it's just like yeah. okay, I, I guess not everybody is is, is doing this uh, this little challenge, I guess. Streamers I try not know. to stream Maybe for one day challenge. Or yeah, that, it's also um, something that sparked outrage last week. Um, uh, Call me Carson announced that he would be coming back to YouTube or, or streaming on YouTube with a with a little minute long YouTube video mm -hmm. where he yeah. where he basically announced it and he's gonna and he said like oh I'm gonna be coming back I'm gonna be live streaming on September first <laughs> and uh, all the money all the money from the stream will be going to charity and everyone got so mad at him not only because mm -hmm. of like what he did because people are still you know, saying that you know, he's a pedophile mm -hmm. and all that shit. Um, and then there are people who are very angry that he would pick September 1st of all days. Um, but I doubt that he knew about it because I didn't even know about it. I like, yeah. and I'm on Twitter all the time. I first heard about it because of that scandal. It, it kind of felt like they created that <laughs> day just to be angry at Carson, where they were like, oh, but, but, um, but on, on September 1st, nobody's supposed to stream, asshole, what are you doing? So, I don't know, but I don't think that that's the case. Yeah, I just think I that it was, I just think it was just like such a small event that like not everybody knew about. And not I doubt, I doubt that it. Carson is doing this on purpose because like, oh, nobody's going to stream. He's going to get all the viewers. Yeah, like, I mean, no. Yeah. <laughs> Whoa. It's not, you know, it's not in everyone's best interest to, you know, assume that everyone is, you know, yeah, I, I can with malice or anything like that. I, exactly. I, I can also, I can hear the angry Twitter users in, in the background. <laughs> like they're yeah, screaming, okay, they're screaming. So for the past 10 minutes, <laughs> yeah. everything that you've been hearing in the background has been a uh, Twitter discussion happening in real life. Okay? <laughs> <laughs> if it Twitter. keeps going, it's going to be the same thing. Okay? There's a Twitter argument going on in the background. Maybe um, we should put on a warning. Warning. <laughs> Screaming. Uh, yeah. Twitter. <laughs> warning. Twitter argument in background. Yeah. Enjoy. Um, <laughs> um, my, my laundry's ready. Holy shit, dude. What the we're fuck? We're talking about, you know, Woo! harassment accounts. And <laughs> yeah. I saw, I read this article on PC Gamer and it was, uh, it was a guy on Twitter, basically who uh wrote this program yeah basically i think i saw it, was, it. yeah it was like a program that wrote <clears throat> did, basically did it, like a fake slur but yeah like he said different he, he variations wrote, of it he yeah kept he, switching out characters with yeah. different characters that like were close to it like an n but like with like a squiggly line on top or something else it would I, keep I, switching Exactly. I saw something similar where somebody wrote the word jogger and then he had some kind of yeah, algorithm. It yeah, it was that. He had an algorithm. He made so much of that. Yeah. It kept like switching. It was like, it made Keep like over 2 million. Yeah, over two different million variations. different variations yeah. with just different like letter, like hyphens and whatnot, what you yeah. call them. It was insane. And Twitch is doing nothing about this because people can just 
people can just write the n-word with a different like oh uh, i found this i but it has a squiddly line on top of it and i found a g that has I mean, this weird like little little dent in it and i yeah. can type it that that way <laughs> yeah it's I uh, think, uh i think the uh well the best solution perhaps behind it or you know i mean a meth maybe like a remedy would yeah. be to like i don't know for each i mean for most users basically if you want to type in a chat you gotta have maybe like an authenticator something something yeah. tied to your account maybe like a phone number you know two two factor authentication yeah that yeah, type yeah. Of deal. two two factor yeah and, and sort of like if you don't have this well then here's just a system-wide like limit like oh you can only put one message in maybe like i don't know 10 50 minutes or something but if but, you're like you know twitch got a phone number attached then you know it shows that you care about your account and you wouldn't yeah. you know toss toss out slurs or something exactly there there is already something similar to that uh, i think twitch has this feature and i have it a applied to my account where like you have to have a two-factor authenticator account to be able to comment or like chat uh, in my in my twitch chat and i think like that's like a tool that's open for everyone but it doesn't matter it seems like a lot of people just they don't care that they, they'll go of the whole fucking eight miles just to just to fucking um just to harass people for no discerning reason whatsoever. They'll just... I mean, th then the best solution would just be you know, to layer more on top Exactly, of yeah. Add more layers to, you know... Yeah. Because their, their auto mod thing that, that even I have activated is not the best. It'll, it'll sometimes, you know, censor words that um don't you know shouldn't be censored at all i think like they'll somebody will write dick in chat and, and it will censor that and i'll just be like okay i mean this is not really a a word that i would say is like bad perhaps i okay i though if it's like a child friendly channel i can see why they'd want to block that and i but like for m me myself i'll go like okay i'll allow dick like you can say dick in chat but if you it's like dick tom yeah, you can say Dick, Richardson. Tom, <laughs> yeah, Homer Simpson. Um, but like, if it's like a if it's like a slur, a homophobic slur, or a racist slur, or something like that, then it should do a better job at catching it. But it seems, like I said, with those with those um, different letters from other languages, that like <clears throat> it doesn't recognize. It can sometimes just like go through, and that's really bad. You don't want that. Um, and like that guy mm. in the um, jogger video showed, there are like two million ways of uh, different uh, that over was two just million. Like ways. One word. That yeah, was just one word. Just for jogger. So the, you know, imagine you know all the different slurs. There, there are so many that would all need to go through this algorithm, and you need to you need to put them into your Twitch account somehow. Um, but I think Twitch just needs to fix this as themselves. It's not. It shouldn't be up to the streamers to fend for yeah. themselves this way the twitch I mean, should do could, better yeah this could be maybe like a perfect opportunity to put like you know like ai artificial intelligence in maybe like into uh i don't know maybe like yeah talking about an auto moderator maybe like yeah a, a, another auto like auto mod but that has like ai built into it to filter stuff yeah Something like that. Something to catch maybe, those you know, those different letters and stuff like that. And if like if it maybe misses something, then you know people can't be like, "Hey, you missed this," and they just hit like a button and it gets added to you know. Yeah. To an index that you know the AI can learn off. Like, ooh, I missed yeah. that. I gotta keep an eye out for that. The 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 auto mod that's already on Twitch does this thing where like if it catches a word, it will block the message from being showed to everyone, but it will show it to the streamer. And then you can decide whether or not, like, okay, this word isn't that bad, I'll allow it. Or this bad is awful, what the fuck, you can decline it and you can, like, delete the message completely. And I think it automatically, like, mutes the user for uh, some time. Um, <clears throat> so you could do that as well. And I think, like, if you're a moderator of a channel, you also see those messages. Because, yeah. um, 
like sometimes I'll do it myself. I'll go like, oh, I'll add this. But sometimes I'll have moderators like like you or, or Foxily or, or stuff in my chat who will who will go, oh, this is not so bad, and they'll allow it. Mm-hmm. Um, and usually I'll tell you when to allow it, but sometimes I'll just read out the message out loud, <laughs> even though it's blocked. And then Fox will just go like, oh, okay, I'll, I'll allow this. As soon as you read it, why not? Uh-huh. Yeah. Um, so this is something that will hopefully be fixed. And like I said, there's like a little protest going on, so I'm not going to stream today, but I will hopefully be uh, up, and, up and running uh, these next couple of days. Though... Um, this semester, I've I've noticed, I, you know, I'm I'm being a lot more active with my with my group of friends at school. So I might have to change my streaming schedule, um, mm-hmm. so that to like sort of compensate because on Friday, there's a little there's a little um, freshman party going to be happening out at this field basically, um, uh-huh. that I might want to go to, and then there's like. A party on Friday and like or on Saturday, I mean, uh, a birthday party and like I want to go to all of these things. Like you know, I want to yeah. I want to go out more and like I want to meet these people. I used to be so um, I used to be a recluse, basically. That's the word I'm looking for. I used to be this hermit mm-hmm. in my shell where I would just barely go outside. And in my first semester, I I didn't really know anyone. Then in my second semester, I started getting to know these people better. And now I I would say I'm pretty good friends with like all of them. I even invited mm-hmm. some people to my house the other day to to watch a movie uh, in my apartment. I think it was last Thursday. We watched um, we watched Fateful Findings by Neil Breen, one of the worst movies nice. I think I've ever watched. But it was so it was so bad that it was kind of, it was laughable. It was really funny, and that's the reason why we watched it. We had heard about this this awful bad bad movie, and we just went, we want to watch this, so we watched it, and it was nice. a lot of fun. So, yeah, and I will probably be inviting friends over some more to watch movies and stuff like that. Um, in fact, I, I way, way off in the future, I've, I've already planned I want to do like a October um, Halloween, like sort of watch a long party where we'll watch some horror movies. Um, mm-hmm. So, yeah, I, I'm get, getting some great friends at film school. I think that's fantastic. I, I, I uh, real nice. Yeah. It's, it's great. It's real nice. <laughs> it's real nice. Though I, I don't really, I, I, I talk to them a lot at school and when we go out and all that stuff. But we, I, I don't really play games with them or anything when I'm at home, even though I know some of them play video games. I don't know why. I gotta do that more. <clears throat> yeah. <laughs> go here. Yeah. <laughs> Goofy. You do that. <laughs> um. Yeah. So, I I like I really like streaming, and I would love to continue streaming. But I I think I'll have to either change my schedule or or stream less or whatever. I don't know what I'm gonna have to do. Um, but like I'm growing so slowly, and I I want to stream more often because I, I like that's what I've heard. Consistency is key. Like the more you mm-hmm. stream, of course, the more people are gonna see you, and the more people yeah. are also gonna. Uh, are gonna join your streams because they're gonna be like, oh, this guy's streaming like every single day. I wanna, I wanna see no him every way. day. And, you know, no way. Um, he's consistent. Yeah, he's consistent. But like, if you um, wanna be consistent, then you just uh, that, that, to the schedule. Yeah, Simple exactly. As that. um, That's my I, opinion. That's yeah. my thought. Exactly. Thank I, you I, much. but while I'm in school, I might have to change it. And then, like, as soon as I graduate, I, I won't immediately become a filmmaker. I'm not going to immediately jump into, like, Hollywood. That's not how it works. What? So what? <laughs> me, You and me, we're going to take my awesome screenplay to fucking James Cameron. To Manhattan. What the fuck? Broadway. No, James Cameron. What the hell? <laughs> I love James Cameron. It's about these two fridges. One is a man fridge. The other is a woman fridge. And they whoa, desperately whoa, whoa. want to fuck. But you know, no. you know the other fridge. What the fuck? <laughs> the other, <laughs> please, please, <laughs> Mr. Cameron, please. Hey, it's me, James Cameron. I say this movie is pretty cool. I greenlight it. What Thank the you. fuck are you doing? I'm trying to make Avatar th- two, three, four, and five to, at the same oh, time. Yeah. <laughs> if you go on, alone. if you go on IMDb, you can see that he's already planned out like what <laughs> all these <laughs> movies doing all the avatars. Who? Okay, honestly, who the fuck remembers Avatar? 
The first one. I've watched it and all I remember was the there's like a hair fucking scene and that's about it. They, sp- they stick their hairs together. Be right back, gotta watch Avatar. <laughs> I saw it in theaters and I remember I uh, falling asleep. I think this is the first movie I ever fell asleep to in a theater. It was um, the first and certainly not the last. Yeah. I, I've I've fallen asleep to other movies in theaters, but You've fallen asleep to not, it doesn't happen that often though. Schindler's List. <laughs> Sophie's Choice. I did not see these in theaters. I wasn't born. Terminator <laughs> 1 and 2. Stop. No. I'm you not that old. You slept through the entire Godfather trilogy. <gasps> I'm not the third that old. Was the best. Uh, I, saw, I almost fell asleep. I saw a movie yesterday that's very slow paced. It was very good. But like. But you fell asleep, so th- it's not that I did, good. I, didn't fall, I did not fall asleep. Yes, but you I was did. Like, <laughs> Don't lie to the audience, okay? Rule was, number one. <laughs> I was struggling to keep myself awake because the, the, the chairs were really fucking, like, uncomfortable. And so, I, like, I had to, like, sort of lay down. And that was making me sleepy. Uh, and the movie was very slow-paced with really, like, relaxing music and, and sounds and stuff like that. But it's this movie called uh, The Green Knight. And... It was um, very good. I don't want to really spoil anything because I, you know, it's a very symbolic Wait. film, and you have to experience it for yourself. So I recommend checking it out. <sighs> I'm gonna have to spoil it for everyone right no. now. The night is green. What the fuck, dude? You are absolutely Sorry. fucking. You are. I'm livid. I'm angry. Sorry. I, this is it. Don't come to my house and kill me. Don't okay. do that. Okay. Opening applications for a new co-host for the Generally <laughs> Speaking podcast. Wasi we'll will be kicked out. Uh, hey, as so as a s a p as they say in, in in French. As soon as popcorn. Popcorn. As they say in Thank French. Mm-hmm. <laughs> That's Pop- French right there. Pop- popcorn. What? Popcorn. Poopcorn? There's some corn in my poop. What? Yeah. Alright. Um, I heard what you said. You <laughs> no. 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 <laughs> I have my rights. I have my rights. Um, I also haven't... I haven't been home in a while i i, I want to go home man i want to i'm at the apartment but i really want to go home but you just said you were home you said you were home alone too <laughs> at the apartment but i want to go yeah. to my my, my parents house i am apartment alone oh you're right fuck i want to go i want to go to my sister i want to go to my my dad and brother i want to go to my cat mostly i want to like meet my Forget cat them. they're gone and i eat them they're, they're gone, gone. You got rid of him. Okay. I ate him. No. <laughs> no. Can't say this. My cat. My okay. kettle and teacup. Okay. I apologize. Yeah? Heat it in grease. Put him in the microwave. <laughs> you open it and the cat's like, meow meow, fucker. My cat would never be in a microwave you can't you can't fool me so, so what he's gonna be in the oven <laughs> you're right where's he gonna be man <laughs> he's gonna be in a frying pan on the stove top why are we talking about why are we talking about cooking cats on the podcast what the fuck what episode is this wait a minute episode 30, 30 is the hell episode and if you convert it to ASCII, you get six, you know, six, I'm six. Like, I'm not gonna say Blah, Satan. Blah. If you curve, convert from decimal to hexadecimal and then to <laughs> ASCII, you get cat. Whoa. That's why we're talking about it. Thank you. <laughs> have you seen? Have you have you seen that video of the of the Christian lady who's like explaining why Monster Energy Drink is like created by the devil or some shit like that? Um, She's I've like heard about it. <laughs> she's like showing off these monster cans and going like okay so as you can see this letter right here in All latin right, yeah. this is six Isn't and so like, this uh, is six 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 the number of the beast and so monster energy drink is actually created by satan and you are indulging I, I, in his in his <laughs> evil de- be- deals what 
I, th I thought it was like, okay, you see the M on Monster Energy Chewing? So those are actually th the three prongs on a pitchfork or something. Oh, yeah, she know. does say that as well. She says like, so, and it, also, if you flip it, look, this looks like the fork, the pitchfork that Satan has. And it's like, what the fuck are you talking about, lady? I don't drink any energy uh. drinks because I fucking don't like the way they taste. But um, this woman what? is just way out of her lane. But she... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, these fairy, yeah. these fairy tale people, these Christians are insane. They're the yeah, same people Christians. that are these That's Christians. Right. These are the I'm same. Get out there. <laughs> these are the same people I have getting documents. What from the CIA <gasps> that show that Christianity is deeply linked in with the person Christian. <gasps> in fact, true. This individual shows true. A I lot can vouch. I vouch for similarities. This. With the Jesus Christ in the Bible, or should Whoa. I say, the Jesus Chan, as he's <laughs> supposed to be called. Somebody's already made that. If you Google Jesus Chan, you're gonna get like a fan-made like little anime girl who's who's Jesus. You googling it right now? <laughs> oh my God! <laughs> am I right? Am I right or am I right? Put this on the screen, man. <laughs> Oh my god, here I'm at. No, I'm not gonna put it up on screen. People, go Google Jesus Chan and you're gonna find some some kawaii anime desuness girls or whatever the fuck. Yeah. I'm, I'm not a weeboo. I've been watching but Owl House on Disney Plus. You just said you were not a weeboo. What gives? That's not a fucking anime. You That's just, just a. <laughs> Ooh, you just said. It's a. It's a. It's a. It's a children's show, but I am five year old, in, five years old in spirit, so I can watch it. Okay, it's okay, it's okay. It's created by, mm. um, it's created by the wife of Alex Hirsch, and Alex Hirsch is also co-writing and voice acting in it, and it's, it's very good. It's on Disney Plus, and I'm enjoying it uh, thoroughly. I'm at like episode nine, I think, or ten, um, mm -hmm. and I think it got. Canceled? canceled something like that i i read that somewhere so i'm like uh oh yeah. i don't know why i don't know why i got canceled so, uh, no more seasons yeah th i think there's two seasons and then it got canceled and i'm uh, i'm gonna watch it i guess it didn't pull i didn't i guess it didn't pull enough ratings man i'm sorry probably yeah <clears throat> foxley watched it and she was like really excited she should have watched it more you know she should have watched it more yeah. and they wouldn't have canceled it this is all your fault. <laughs> this is all your fault, Owl House fans. Should have watched it more often. Hmm. If you like it mm. so much, then why didn't you watch it more, huh? Yeah. Clearly um, shows that the demographic <laughs> of viewers, you know, they didn't like owls because, you know, of course, <laughs> they suck. <laughs> but it's got a also, very similar... Well, you watched Gravity Falls, right? Or have you not seen it yet? No. Oh, what the bitch? Gravity Falls is one of my favorite like animated TV shows. I gotta watch it with you, man. When you, oh, when you got to, when you get to your apartment and you're closer to me than we are now, then you gotta like come over and we'll have like a little watch party, watch Gravity Falls, and then you can make me watch whatever show you want me to watch. Cause it's like, because <laughs> there's this really awesome TV show. I think it's called The Samsons. No, I'm already watching. I started Samson? watching it. No, you Smither no, Smithers is no. black in episode two of season one. He's not. He's not. And, they, and then they changed him because they're racist. Matt Groening is racist. Groening, Groening. How do Have you, you say his name? Have you seen what? this latest project? No. It's the Turing machine. I'm <laughs> sorry. That's an awful joke. What? Okay. <laughs> Matt Groening. Matt Groening. He he. The the only thing of The Simpsons I've really watched, uh, every now and then I saw some episodes when I was at my my cousin's house because like they actually, well I probably could have watched it as well in my house or at my house because like this channel that it was on this TV station, um, mm. they they would air it right after news and like you could watch the news for free. And then, like, yeah. you could actually catch the Simpsons episode afterwards. And sometimes they would, like, get cut off abruptly because they would be like, wait a minute, turn it off, turn it off. They can't, uh -huh. <laughs> you can't, they can't watch anymore. <laughs> They're not paying for the Shut station. The <laughs> um, 
Um, but like, yeah, sometimes I would see episodes at their house because they loved watching the episodes right after after their news on like Thursdays or something. It was like every every weekend, or, like on a single day, I think. Um, but um, when I watched them myself, I would usually watch the, the um, Treehouse of Horror episodes because I really liked those. I like everything horror related. I would, you would pirate them or I would find them on like illegal you websites, virus evil. virus filled websites. <laughs> little, little. That's one of my websites. Thank you very much. And that's why my computer has HIV, AIDS, and uh, uh, other STDs, <laughs> other and STDs, cancer, <laughs> and dysentery, and scurvy, and all those scurvy cool things. And... <laughs> yeah. So yeah, I'm I'm now watching all of The Simpsons from season one, and some of my friends at school were like, "Oh, season one is so bad. It's such a bad season. It's only good from season three up to season eight. Did you curb stomp them as soon so, as they said that? Yeah, I threw a melon at their head. Like all of them. I, I brought one melon for each of them and just threw a melon at their head. Yeah. <laughs> also, also have a friend at school right now that I, I think, I, I hope he's trolling me, but he says that Interstellar is not a good movie. Um, and he said that it's Christopher Nolan's worst movie, and and I just I want to <laughs> slap him silly. I want to slap him around. I want to make sure that he looks upside down. What? Where does he live? <laughs> How old is he? <laughs> drone, drone strike him. He. What is the color of his I, eyes? I, I I said like, what the fuck? You think Interstellar is Christopher Nolan's worst movie? <laughs> Have you seen Tenet? And he just went, Tenet is like miles better. And I like everyone <gasps> in class just stared at him like, what the fuck is this guy on? What is he? What is he? <laughs> <laughs> Fucking PCP. crazy person. Yeah. Acid. Acid. Uppers, downers. <laughs> Caffeine. Caffeine. Depression meds. <laughs> Birth control. Like, what the fuck? Psycho meds. <laughs> this guy's Older in pills. <laughs> Mentats. <laughs> CPAP. <laughs> Simpax. Dialysis machine. <laughs> uh, uh, <laughs> blood donation. He's got, like, thousands of things hooked up to him. Yeah. <laughs> Leeches. <laughs> Leeches. He's, He's having... in an iron lung. <laughs> How do you get in here? Horse, horse medicine. <laughs> he's, <laughs> he's, horse medicine. <laughs> he's taking horse medicine like everyone in the USA is doing today. He's got an oxygen tank next to him. <laughs> uh, I haven't actually seen that news, but I just like everyone at school was sort of talking of, or I just saw it on Twitter, and then people at school were talking about like people in US in the US like using horse medicine for some reason. What the fuck was what? Do you know anything about that? What was that? Yeah. What was it? It's something called ivermectin, and it's like horse worm medicine. What? It deworms the horse. <laughs> and, and what yeah. happened? And people think, oh, I don't need to wear a mask or get vaccinated. I just, I just put this in me instead. The, oh, and my. Get rid of it. What the fuck? What? Of COVID? Yeah. That's uh, <laughs> All right. That's supposed to be the solution. Sick, dude. Good job, guys. Your 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 genius is over there. I you saw a video. You. Saw a video of a British kid crying because he he had apparently quote unquote um, uh, proof from the doctor. The doctor said that he didn't have to wear a mask to go to school, and the parent and uh, it was like. <laughs> crying and these parents were recording him crying and saying like these people are awful they're awful but uh, the thing the thing is parents you're awful what the fuck are you putting in your child's head telling them like oh you don't have to wear a mask these they're they were anti-maskers by the way they were like these people that just like refused to wear a mask didn't want their son to wear a mask because if you wear a mask you're a big raging pussy and it's just like what the fuck just fucking wear a mask it's not that hard why would you say that that's very rude (laughs) This is a fucking child crying and they're filming it for people to look at on the internet. How much of a piece of shit parent can you be? Yeah, man. <laughs> it's just it's, it's stupid. Go uh, ahead, take your horse medicine. <laughs> take your horse medicine, all right? Britain, join on join in. Join on in. Join on in. Um uh and also speaking of COVID, apparently there's a new variant of the COVID thing going that was found in what brazil or something and 
Like yeah. the the student that read that news out loud in class yesterday was like, "Oh my God, there's a new variant! Are you kidding me?" And then somebody said, "Where?" And he said, "Brazil." <laughs> somebody went like, "You're going to Brazil." Yeah, and somebody went like, "Oh, it's in Brazil. It's so far away." And then like the, another really pessimistic kid just goes, "Ah, it's gonna be here by tomorrow." <laughs> <laughs> it's like yeah somebody from brazil is gonna come over to iceland immediately like oh new variant we gotta share this hey with the, we gotta share this with the rest of the world check, check it out what i got look what, what i did look what i did um i think it's in brazil i don't remember what the fuck he said was it spain brazil it was somewhere <clears throat> in like a spanish-speaking country i'm pretty sure um <clears throat> yeah but um yeah, this is this is something that's not going away. I'm 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 I I've come to terms with that COVID is here to stay yeah. and we're going to keep seeing variants and we're going to keep yeah. seeing spikes and it's just a uh, uh, fucking fuck. Great. Whatever. And just, we're going to keep seeing more of that mRNA. Yeah. Medicine <laughs> the, technology yeah. thing. And we're going to see more of people come in their iron lungs evolve. Yes. <laughs> Look at this student. He's in film school. He's hooked up to an iron lung. He's perfectly fine again. <laughs> Just like making fun of people in iron lungs. What the fuck's wrong there's, with us? There's only like what? One guy left? Really? In like one of these things? Huh. I saw a video of someone in an iron lung the other day and it looked um, really cozy. I want to try it out. <laughs> I mean, I, I I saw a video of a guy. I think he had pole. No, no, fuck it. I don't remember. Yeah, he had like Screw he that. had like chicken pox or something. It was really he had serious. Chicken pox. That's why he was the last man on earth in an hour long. Yeah. Okay. He still had the black death vir like virus. He had to be in. Yeah, hair. he he should have done an antivirus scan. Exactly. <laughs> all right well you know what we're gonna head out we're gonna go you know sit down in our iron lungs and you know think about things so um <laughs> here we go <laughs> I really gotta fart. <laughs>